Hello and welcome to Ocean Interaction, your go-to channel for all the things game and game related. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create gradient materials. This video is divided into two parts. In the first part, I'm going to show you how you can create gradient materials with the built-in tools. And on the second part, I will be showing you how you can create the gradient materials with say, some textures. Don't worry, I will be also showing you how you can create this texture as well. Let's get started. So first, I'm going to set up a basic project to showcase the materials. I'll be creating a blank blueprint project in a default location. Let's just name it Gradient. Now, I will create a new empty map to showcase the material. I will be creating and showcasing you this material in a widget, but this method can be used to create any kind of material with the gradient colors. Okay, so I have created this simple widget with just an image so that I can show you the material colors. I'm going to set this image into the level blueprint so that whenever I play game, I see this widget displayed. Okay, looks great. Now, I will also create one material to create a gradient colors. I will name it M underscore gradient color. To set this material in an image, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this main node and select the material domain to user interface so that I can show this material in a widget image. So I'm going to select this image and set this new material. To test it out, I'm going to create this simple color, assign it to this material, make this any of the random colors, save and go to this widget and as you can see this widget has been updated with this new color and so now when I play, uh, play this I will see this widget or specifically this material color. So we are good to go. Now we can start creating the gradient material. For the first part I am going to create a gradient material with Unreal Engine's built-in node systems. Okay. So let's get started. So open up your material and create two colors. So we already have uh, one, uh, this one. We will be also providing uh, some random color uh, to this uh, second uh, second vector three node, which is our color, right? And now we are going to lurk between these colors. So you can you can uh, search for lurk and you will find this node linear interpolate or you can just simply uh, press L and left uh, mouse button and it will also create you a lurk node. We will assign the first into the A first color and second color into the B. And now for the alpha what we are going to do is a right click and search for gradient. and we have this linear gradient uh, okay so let's assign this to alpha and a final color with this lurk node as you can see created a nice little uh, gradient okay now what you can do if if you want to change the direction of the radiance color you can uh, change the uh, change the alpha node to one of these u or v coordinates okay so it will create you a horizontal or vertical gradient effects. Now this is the first uh, type of gradient that we can create. Now for the second type search for and diamond gradient. Connect to the alpha and as you can see it has created this diamond shape gradient color. To increase the size of this middle uh, diamond shape what you can do is press 1 and left mouse button and link this scalar node with the diamond gradient and assign the value 1. As you can see it has increased the diamond shape value. Now to create third type of gradient search for radial gradient this node ok. Assign it 
to the alpha and it will create this round shape of gradient color for you now this is the first method which we can use the built-in tool, uh, tools provided by Unreal Engine to create a gradient colors. Now, for the second method, what we will do is create a texture and use that as an our alpha for the gradient. Okay, so don't worry, uh, this project is uh, with the CC0 license will available in our Discord server. Uh, link is in the description, so you can join our Discord server and get these assets for free. Now, for the second method, open up your browser and search for Photopy. Go to this website. And create a new project. We will be naming this gradient. And for the size, we can create this 720 by 720. Any size will work. Create. So we have created this new project so that we can create our texture for the gradient color. Click on this uh, gradient tool and click on this new fill layer. Now as you can see it has uh, created us a black and white gradient color uh, linear gradient image. I prefer this method over built-in tool because this way I can create how much gradient or uh, what is the angle or the size of the gradient that I want to choose or add it. So as you can see, if I want this, uh, I can uh, make this angle 45 degree and I have completely different gradient type. You can rotate it in any direction that you want. I will download this image. Go to files and export as PNG. You can name it whatever you want and make sure quality is 100% and just save this image. We are going to create or uh, two more gradient colors, okay? Click on this gradient and click on this new fill layer. And for and for the second gradient type, we are going to choose a radial. Go to files and download this image as well. Now for the last uh, type, we are going to choose a diamond. Save this image as well. So as you can see, we have imported all of these images into our project. And now choose one of these as an alpha value instead of the built-in node. So as you can see I have dragged this image into our new our material and when and when I choose this image as an alpha I will get nice gradient colors. So now let's play and see how it looks. So as you can see it has created a nice gradient color. Now let's test out this second image. As you can see it has created this gradient color effect based on this image remember the you can download this project from the description link it is with the cc0 license so you can use it this project anywhere or however you want you can join our server and get access to all the other projects as well see you there